We are here today with Coach Langen, head coach of the Felician baseball team, to discuss the upcoming season that is about to start. You've been here since the 2004 season, and with your recent teams have been able to achieve an unprecedented degree of success at the university. What have been the keys to get the program to this level? Wow. Um, first of all, thanks for, uh, for this opportunity today to come out and talk to you guys and uh, you know, let our fans know a little bit more about the program. I don't think there's been any real secret. Um, I think we just went out and found some blue collar type players that are, uh, you know, just grinders, guys that want to win. They like to compete. Um, they've created an awesome family type atmosphere. Um, and, and we've got some really good coaches that work with these guys and show a lot of love um, and care to them. So I think that's about it. The team is ranked second in the CCC North Division preseason poll. Uh, how do you feel about that? Me personally, I, I'm not a big fan of any of the polls. I don't think that matters much. Um, I think for our guys, it's bulletin, uh, you know, bulletin board material. You know, I think the, when you take a deeper look at the poll, we did get the fir almost first place votes. So I think some of our guys feel slighted about that. But you know, as I've kind of told them, um, it really doesn't matter where we start. It's about where we're going to finish. So, you know, just extra motivation. So Edwin Tavares and Levi Zagla were named preseason All East. What are you expecting from them, and who are some other key returning players? Yeah, both Edwin and Levi's are tremendous players. Um, Edwin's more of the home run type, um, you know, long ball guy, where Levi's is more of a guy who's going to wear out pitchers, grind at bats, and just seems to always have a knack for getting a big hit. Um, I think we have a really talented team. Um, honestly, I think any of the starting nine that play are guys that are going to you know, be big contributors. Um, names off the top of my head, transfer Ralph Gambino. Uh, Darwin Matos is going to be our opening day starter. He's going to play in the uh, MLB Draft League. Um, you know, transfer from uh, Bloomfield College, Wilfredo Valenzuela. They call him Wi-Fi. And I think he's a guy who's going to definitely, uh, you know, pay uh, big dividends for us. Um, Dari Genoa, uh, there's just a bunch of guys. Um, as far as freshmen are concerned, I think guys are going to step in right away. Um, Luis De La Cruz, Andy Antonio, uh, Logan Waltz, Mike Caldone. Those guys are pitchers. Danny Robeson, the left-hand pitcher, Makai Sanchez. Um, I just think we're pretty balanced. We, we have a good mix of uh, really, really talented young players and then obviously some very good, you know, experienced older ones as well. Um, do you think we're past issues related to COVID? And do you have any other final thoughts as we approach Friday's opener? I mean, I think we all think and hope that COVID is going to kind of be behind us or at least we're going to have to live with it. Um, so I'm hoping those things are way behind. We don't have to worry about that at all because obviously we cut our season short last year. And uh, I'm just excited, you know, excited for the guys and excited for the opportunity to start the 19th season here. Um, playing great opponents early on, especially Nova Southeastern. It's just going to give us a good test to let us know where we're going to be at. Um, obviously, I know, you know, where we are today in, in February, we're not going to be the same team in April. Uh, we're just hoping that we can keep getting better and better every day and uh, hopefully achieve our goal of getting back to the playoffs and uh, you know, giving ourselves a chance at the postseason uh, regional berth. Thank you very much for your time today and good luck this season. I appreciate it. Thank you guys so much.